Ashley. And I'm Lachlan. And we're getting mar married in November this year. Um, we started our planning and didn't really have an idea of what we wanted. Started having a look around all different places, pretty much found what we wanted, fell in love with it all and then priced it all up. And now we're just kind of making that work. It's going to cost us, what, about $26,000 $26, in total? That's what it's coming to. Don't know how we're going to manage it, but we're going to make it work. <laughs> <laughs> the suits he's got to oh, organise, yeah? I've yeah. the suits and that'll pretty much be it for me. At the beginning he was a bit of a groomzilla though, any decision I made he needed to make sure that it was perfect and what he wanted, but now he's kind of got over that <laughs> and I'm allowed to do it all now, so it's pretty good. <laughs> oh, yeah, we had big issues. We had uh, put the deposit down for Jan Shep and then we found out that my brother wasn't going to be able to come over from England. So we were tried to change it all to move to Bali so that he could come and then many other issues after that. Means that we had to just pretty much go back to plan A. Plan, yeah. yeah, which is what we wanted originally, so that's worked out well. Mm. <laughs> just having everything just organized and, and paid over for. With and we've got fam I've got family coming over from England, Locke's got family coming over from over east, so it's going to be really nice having everyone together and like there's people I haven't seen for eight years and there's people Locke hasn't even met yet in his family. So just having that kind of reunion with everybody is just going to be fantastic. Should be good. <laughs> we had our engagement shoot last week. We had it at um, Kuji Beach. We took our dog with us. It was like it was really good fun. He um, actually nearly knocked over Sky and nearly smashed the camera, but we managed to save that one, <laughs> which was a bit awkward. But it was really, really good fun, and it's going to be awesome having the guest book to be able to, for everyone to be able to see those photos and see the difference from normal everyday us to all glitzed and glammed and wedding day us. And, have that as like part of like memory and seeing Zeus as a puppy and everything with us and then when we get married he's gonna be bigger and being able to see he's like on the baby so <laughs> doing all that. But we met Sky through Locke's sister's wedding um, in 2012, I think it was. 2012, and um, Sky was their photographer, and we just we all had so much fun. We were in the bridal party, and we were just jumping around. It wasn't all just like formal photos, just standing there and doing like fake smiles. It was like really good fun and interactive, and everyone just had an absolute ball. That was probably like my favourite part of the day was getting all the photos taken because it was just so much fun and so when we decided to get married that was the thing straight away it was like we've got to have Sky. there's no way that we could have anybody else she was just great and the photos that came out they they were true photos they weren't just stage photos that everyone was having a laugh and you could see that and that's looking through Meg's photos now like it gets me a bit teary like just seeing like how everyone just did have such good fun and everything was great <laughs> I know, it was good fun, I enjoyed it as well, like the whole mucking around aspect and it was good, getting everything sorted. <laughs> That just looks like awesome fun and it's a chance to bounce around. Locke's not as keen on it as I am because my family just loud and just burst into song and everything and like I just reckon that's just a really good keepsake like for the day, just something like it's not something you need to broadcast to everyone but you can all get together in the future and just laugh about it. Nothing. We will do when it comes, like when our invitations arrive, we will have to do some DIY on them to like put everything together so it looks all look pretty. But other than that, we're not very crafty people, so if other people can do it for us, more the better. Pay <laughs> Just pay for it to get done, pretty much. Centerpieces will probably do some on that, but other than that, nothing. <laughs> Just really work out what you want and don't get caught up in the whole the days for everybody else because at the end of the day it's not. You're walking down the aisle to marry the man that you're in love with and that's what the day is. The frills and everything, it doesn't matter. So if, no matter what your budget is, don't go over it, don't go stupid because then you just end up getting stressed about money and that's not what you want to start your married life together. Thanks, see you in November! <laughs>